Patrick, that coach Gary Pinkle after today's game in Arkansas. And coach, how hard has this been the last week in particular with, with you leaving and everything? I know it's, it's been difficult to, to manage here. With well, it's the last two and a half weeks. I mean, you know, it was such a shock, I think, before the BYU game that I don't think it had really registered with anybody. But what happens is, is there's just a lot of uh, uncertainty, you know, and, and the players are at the locker room. Who's going to be the coach? And, and these things can't be prevented. You know, there's a process to hiring a coach. So it's happened in other places too. And it just, it just was, and I, I tried to overcome that. And I do a very good job getting our team to be able to focus, you know, through all that stuff. And that's probably what I'm most disappointed in. What can you say about the effort of your kids, though? I mean, they, they, they continue trying to push through, and, and you've, you've never seen any quit in anybody in that room. No, it's really great. And, I, you know, again, as I, when I was in there, I, I talked to the team, and I said the seniors, I said the most distractions that I've ever seen, you know, since I've you know, probably been coaching in one year. And we've had to overcome, and, and, and the leadership was awesome. And our younger guys, we've got so many great kids in here that, uh, you know, the future looks very bright for Missouri football. What are your plans moving forward? Uh, I'm going to probably hopefully, you know, uh, you know, work, work uh, something out with the university. I think I can be an asset. I love Mizzou and, and spent 15 years here. And, and, I, and I, I, I want to see the Mizzou football program go a lot higher than Gary Pinkle had it. So, you know, hopefully great things are going to happen. And uh, any way I can help, I'll, I'll certainly will. You've never been one to look back, but now that you, you kind of look at the totality of your 15 years here and, and especially where, where things were when you walked in the door for the 2001 season. You know, what are your, your overall thoughts on, on the run of you and the coaching staff? Well, there's a, you know, a lot of, first of all, great coaches around me and players. And, uh, you know, we, uh, you know the, the numbers are going to speak for themselves at the end of the day. I didn't want it to end like this. I don't think anybody wants it to end like this. But uh, but in the end of the day, too, you know, we, we ran the program integrity and, and we always did what was right for kids. And it was important to you know help them you know as young men and, and students and, and, and it isn't that isn't just you know the sound the, the sound bites that have to you have to say we really did that in our program and I and I that's probably what I'm most proud of. Things have changed so much, especially the winning here. Is is that what you're most proud of? What are you most proud of? Well, I, again the relationship with the player, but the, the program's obviously going to another level. I mean you know we've done a lot of good things here and. You know, five divisional championships in the last nine years and, and a lot of other stuff. So there's a lot of good things that have happened, and, uh, you know, I just wish it would have ended a little bit better. Me too, Gary. Thank you for your time. Thanks. Thank you. Head coach Gary Pinkle.